We will be discussing about the ways to improve the body's communication and language. Alright, here are the needs of our last meeting. Let's get our way to it. Okay, but if you to attended the last meeting and you will see no absentee, please look fine. Item 1 and 2 look fine too. The next item method arising, the proposal to cooperate with the international company in order to build the company performance has been approved. It states here that the bonus company from Turkey approached our company to join them in the next project in April next year. Key workers have been appointed to handle our first project with the international company. This is in this agenda. I think we will find the review date of the project before we complete. The project will begin in the next few days. So, Mrs. Usna, the group is not on there. Thank you, Ms. Azwa, for writing the error. Okay, what about the rest of the names? There is one. One was the error in the spelling of the representative's name from Bond's company. Oh, yes, the correct spelling is Mehmet Ali. Oh, okay, thank you, everyone. Is there anything else to remember? No. No, I don't find any error. If that is the case, someone knows that the needs of the last meeting will be accepted. I propose that the needs be accepted. I second the motion. Okay, I hereby confirm the needs of the last meeting with a few amendments. Okay, let's move on item 2 on the agenda, method arising. The issue of the international market is having problems due to the regulatory's poor communication in English. Mrs. Na, can you brief us on that? Can you can use the chairman? Well, as we all know, issue as energy deals with international market, market, which requires communication and good relationship with other countries due to transport, the merchandise, contact and communicate with embassies and our delegate parties. Employee must possess a good English language as the requirement when deals with international market. Therefore, I suggest we discuss ways to improve the employee's communication in English. That is a brilliant idea. I suggest that campaigns and programs must be helped to improve employees' communication in English. I see no objection to that. Since there are no more objections, it is agreed that campaign and programs should be carried out to improve employees' communication in English. Okay, if there is nothing else, I would like to give the floor to Ms. Azwa. She will present about the first program. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I'm planning to make a one-minute speech program. This activity will be held monthly. It's because I think that this program is more suitable to be held monthly. We will give the right to employees to choose their own topic. Besides, they must create a... Some in something interesting while they give a speech. And this program will not just improve their English but can make them become a critical thinker and more creative. For every speech, where there will be a judge to evaluate and give them mark. So the most creative and the best speech can get a present. They might they must use a good pronunciation and good proverbs to get a better mark. Besides, this program can enhance our employees to become an international level speaker. Every department must send their representative to represent the department in giving a one-minute speech. To run this program, only a small cost is needed. Excuse me for interrupting. I agree with the method of procedures of this program, but about the topic, I think we should give the a specific topic uh, to the employees. It is because it can avoid them from giving a speech that is not related or suitable to the company business. You have a point there, but for me, when we give that chance to employees to choose their topic freely, it can make them become a creative person and we can see and develop their talented that can give a lot benefit to our company. In addition, this program can make our employees automatically study the right pronunciation of the words in their speech and English proverbs to make their speech become more interesting. I agree entirely with you mostly on the tape. 
It is because by doing so much with the program, it can make us distracted. Could you explain to me how the program management is going to work? Sorry, I probably not making it clear. For this program, it must be participated by everyone. So, what I mean is this program is going to be handled by every department and every group of department must take part in handling this program. That's true, but I think there will be some battle between department in handling the program. As to make sure all the departments involved in managing this program, we need to give reward to the department that manage this program. I can't say I share your view. This program can be managed by every department, so it's not necessary to give the reward. Each group must send one representative and one person to join a program's managing group. Um, excuse me, I agree with the procedures and method in the handling progress of this program. I propose that this program should be handled by one department only at a time as it will make them easier to discuss about programs management. That's not always true. For me, if different departments handle this program, it will be so nice and they can get to know each other and automatically the company will be more established. From this program, they will be more brave to give a speech and to speak out their minds. This program can make their English better. By com communicating well in English, it will make them easy to handle companies international market which will result in increasing of company sales. Yes, there is no question about it. So this program can be a great solution to companies international market program. So let's move on to the next item on the agenda. As you know, we are planning to build an English week program to overcome the problem of employees' communication in English. Ms. Adina would like to introduce this item. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, for information and planning to have three activities in this English week program, which are English cafe, book sharing, and language games. The objective of this program is to expose the employees with English language regularly. Besides, this program can enhance and improve their communication skills, a part of to build their confidence to speak up their mind. Excuse me, Ms. Adina. Could you explain to me how that is going to work? As I stated before, there will be three activities in this English group program. Firstly, uh, English Cafe. As we can see from the name of this activity, it will be held in cafe. The employees have to speak in English when chatting or placing their order to expose them with daily conversation in English. It doesn't matter if they make mistakes as we learn from our mistakes. Plus, while having their mouth watering foods and drinks, the employees can hear or watch an array of English speech that will be shown in cafe's television. When they are regularly exposed by this kind of activity, their English communication skill will be improved in no time. That sounds like a very good idea. Thank you, Ms. Aini. As for the second activity that I would like to suggest in this program is book sharing activity. We can have a 30 minute slot maybe on Monday or Thursday twice a week to run this activity. In this 30 minute slot, 5 to 6 employees will be given around 5 minutes for each one of them to tell their colleagues and co-workers about a book that he or she has read from bookshelf that has been provided. Through this activity, the employees' interpersonal skill will be improved and they will be more confident to speak what's on their mind and their opinion about something. Excuse me for interrupting. In my opinion, I think some employees will be burdened to read a book as it will cost them a lot of time in order to read and tell their colleague about the book. Sorry, I'm probably not making myself clear. What I mean about this book sharing activity if it's not necessary for them to read a thick book. They can read a thick one, maybe about 10 to 15 pages book, and it will only cost them 15 to 20 minutes per book. What's important here is that it will enhance their reading skill and they will be the have they will have the confidence to tell their opinion about the book. Have I made that clear? Exactly, I couldn't agree more. Um, so, for the last activity in this English free program is language game. The games that will be held is grammar game and how to answer common ask questions 
about marketing and sales. Interesting prizes will be given to the winner uh, so that they can motivate the employees to do their best in the game. As for this activity, we can have a game between groups. This is to make uh, the, the employees become close to each other as they work together to play the game. Besides, it is to build a team, a strong uh, team spirit and cooperation and to make them realize that their work will remain unfinished without cooperation between each other. Um, excuse me, as you mentioned before, there will be prize for winners to encourage them to give their full passion to play the game. Could you give some detail please? Yes, maybe just a small prize would be enough such as a mug, a book and souvenir. It does seem small but they will appreciate it as they work hard to give their best to the game and prove that there is improvement in them to enable them to win. Plus, the employees will have a little break from their heavy daily tasks about their work and they can relax their mind a bit. Yes, I feel the same way too. Aside from having fun and joyful time, this program will teach them to be a responsible leader and help them polish their English communication and language skills. You are absolutely right. Uh, this program allows them to be consistent at using English language to communicate as English cafe will be held every day. Mm, you have a very good point there. From this program, it will make them feel brave to speak and communicate in English. Even though they are still in the learning process, it will also make them realize that they don't have to be an expert to enable them to speak in English. Okay, so far we have agreed with two programs on how to improve the employees' command of the language. Miss Aini, would you like to introduce the next item on the agenda? Thank you, Mrs. Chairman. For your information, the next item on the agenda is one-on-one -on -one English seminar program. For this program, the employee will be given a deeper exposure to English grammar and vocabulary to make it transform. I suggest we hire a professional speaker from the best company in Asia to share. I'm sorry, I think this program is not suitable for our employees because learning grammar and vocabulary is more about education and learning process while our focus right now is about communication. I see your point, Ms. Gina. So, anyone have a new idea about suitable activities for this program? I think that we can give activities activity. Oh, I'm sorry, I missed that. Could you repeat that, please? Allow me to rephrase, we can do the face-to-face -face activity. In this activity, the speaker will give a secret way on how to speak well in English for one hour. Then, based on the information that the employee get, we need to fulfill the task in group, which each group has two members only. Each group need to find a foreigner and speak with them in English language for three minutes. And after they complete the first task, they need to sing an English song in front of the foreigner as a reward for the foreigner because they are willing to spend their time. Uh, and I suggest to hold this program outside of the company, which means this, out, uh, this is outdoor program. From this program, the employee will get a new experience and they will get the courage to face any foreigner. That's exactly what I feel. These activities also will enhance their skill in communication and also it will improve and strengthen their pronunciation in English. Yeah, that's how I see it too. Excuse me for interrupting. I'm afraid that I don't share the same view. Don't you think that this program will lead us into the greater cause? I agree with you entirely, Ms. Husna. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. The activity of this program is quite good and acceptable. It just counts as a big cost when inviting the best speaker in Asia. I see what you mean, but don't you think that if we want the best for our employee, we need to sacrifice more. In addition, our company deals with international market, so we must make sure our employee must possess a good English language. I think we are running short of time, so let's take a boat on it and move on. I love the activity of this program. I'm with Aini on it. I also agree with Ms. Aini and Ms. Aswa. So, most of us are agree. Let's proceed with this program. 
If there is nothing else, I would like to give the floor to Ms. Husna. She will present about the next program. Thank you, Mrs. Chairman. I am planning to create a word streak of English. As the name of program, we put an info of English pronunciation or proverb and any interesting fact about other international country on a wall at Main Street in our company. Each group from marketing and advertising department should manage this work and change it for every month. I agree. I mean you on this. We also can put a list of employees' names that are very successful and participate in all of our English program. That's how I see it too. Mm, could you explain to me how that is going to work? Oh, sorry. I am probably not making myself clear. What I mean is this program occurs at the main street in our company. As the main street, not only certain employees will learn and take advantage in this program, but it also involves all employees of this company. Posting and info about other countries will also benefit us because as we dealing with international market, we must to co communicate well and also have a good relationship with other country. Precisely, when our employees have a knowledge about the company they are dealing with, they will be more brave and also it can make a good relationship with private company. Also, it will increase our sales. I agree. Besides doing so much of program, we also need to apply the knowledge that they got in the, in the real world. They need a space that can add their knowledge and put their skill on the next level. That's true, but I think at the coming year, we put our own to the likes. What I mean here, we can do this program or see program in a blog or company website as to make sure all the employees get an involved to this uh, program. We need to give other benefit and award or reward points uh, that can be collected and changed. Uh, excuse me for interrupting. I agree with the method of procedures of Google Street program. I propose that this program should be handled by IT department. It is because company only have to invest a small budget as the company have a IT department. The IT department can handle and manage the website properly and successfully. Through their skill, this program should get a full support from all employees. You have a point there. So, the whole thread program handled by IT department in a website and create an award or reward point to create a demand among employees to join this program. Uh, is there any other business to discuss? I suggest we go round the table. Ms. Adina? Um, let's go Ms. Adina. Uh, Ms. Akila? Mm, no. Ms. Amy, how about you? Yes, Mr. Chairman. Well, we have prepared many programs to the company in order to improve the employee's communication in English. So, what about the duration that we have to accomplish all this program? In my opinion, uh, we settled all these suggested within three months. After that, we analyzed the program that has been achieved among all the employees. If any lacking had occurred, we have several months to fix it. That's a very good idea. This good planning will drive our company to produce employees that have quality rather than quantity. Uh, what is the committee's view on that? I completely agree with that idea. There's no doubt about it. Yes, me too. Okay, so if there is no more objection, we will speak the idea to settle all the program within three months. Is there anything else? No, no. no. Right, let's bring this meeting to a close for today. Can we schedule the next meeting, please? A month from now, on April 18, 2020, uh, time and venue will be in Kongheter. Okay, that is that. Thank you for your attendance and participation. I declare this meeting.